Trenton Waterworks finds itself in the middle of another controversy. The State Department of Health on Saturday revealed the presence of Legionella in the water supplies of homes served by the utility in central Jersey. Legionella is the bacteria that causes Legionnaire's disease, a type of pneumonia, and was found in more than half of 30 homes sampled in September, including in Trenton, Ewing, parts of Hopewell and Lawrence townships. The sampling started after Legionnaire's disease was previously detected in Hamilton Township and comes just days after the State Department of Environmental Protection announced they take on oversight of operations at Trenton Waterworks due to, quote, significant health and safety concerns for people served by the utility. Well, lawmakers are holding a hearing at the State House today to get input from elected officials and others about the situation. I'm joined now by New Jersey State Epidemiologist Dr. Tina Tan to get more insight on this situation. Dr. Tan, first of all, thank you for joining us. I think one of the um, items that comes to folks' mind is if my water was sampled and the bacteria was detected, am I more likely or am I prone to contract this disease? You know, it's unknown whether people um, with Legionella bacteria that are detected in their homes are more likely to develop Legionnaire's disease, which is a more um, serious infection associated with uh, Legionella bacteria. Um, but even so, even if you're exposed to Legionella bacteria, typically speaking, healthy people do not become sick with um, severe illness. But the risk of becoming sick um, is higher um, depending on um, various individual risk factors, um, including the type of Legionella species that might be present, and also whether or not you might have some underlying health conditions. So for example, um, some health um, considerations that might put you at increased risk for more serious illness are if you're um, 50 years or older, mm. um, if you're a smoker, um, if you have certain medical conditions, including weakened immune systems, um, chronic lung disease, or other chronic health conditions. Can you contract uh, Legionnaire's disease simply from drinking the water? How do you actually um, become infected? Yeah, people cannot get Legionnaire's disease or infection by uh, with Legionella bacteria by drinking the water. Um, although it's uncommon, you know, people can get sick, you know, if you're um, drinking water and then the water goes down the wrong pipe um, and gets into your lungs. But typically the way that you become infected is if you breathe um, water that's aerosolized, you know, the small droplets of water in the air. Um, and if the water does contain that Legionella bacteria. So are we talking about things like taking a shower? Is it as simple as that? Um, you know, sometimes um, if you don't maintain your um, shower head, that might be a potential risk factor for um, developing um, exposures to aerosolized um, droplets containing um, uh, Legionella bacteria. But, you know, typically speaking, um, we're concerned about um, any sort of exposure from um, uh, 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 settings where, you know, you might have increased amounts of aerosolized water. So um, also, you know, looking at um, hot tub use, um, being near decorative fountains that might mm. um, have all sorts of water sure. um, aerosols, as well as power washers. Um, we also want to remind people that, um, you know, if you do use um, some devices that require water, so for example, if you need medical equipment, right. such as um, the CPAP and the BiPAP machines, you know, you got to follow those manufacturer instructions, um, and that often includes using sterile water instead of tap water. We worked in conjunction with the uh, federal CDC, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, to develop a list of best practices for homeowners and businesses to follow to reduce the potential for Legionella bacteria. And what's your message to folks who are, you know, rightly uh, concerned uh, about this and concerned about, you know, Trenton Waterworks as a whole? Yeah, you know, we certainly um, recognize that um, people um, might be concerned about their health, particularly if they have, um, you know, some underlying um, health conditions that might put them at more risk for um, severe illness with uh, Legionella bacteria. And um, the important thing is that um, um, if you are concerned and if you uh, are receiving service from uh, Trenton Water Works, that, you know, if you think you have symptoms of uh, Legionnaire's disease, you know, so that 
that could include cough, um, shortness of breath, uh, fever, muscles aches, um, headaches, you know, please seek um, a, a consult and evaluation with your healthcare provider. An important note there. Dr. Tina Tan, thanks so much. Thank you.